here's my latest project, the automatic garden water. Um, I've written, written a lot about it. Finally installed it in my girlfriend's house. Just mounted it to the wall right here. Uh, what we have is this cable, this power cable, runs over there by the door. You can see it plugged in. This bottom cable goes to a solenoid, which controls when the water is on and off. And goes through here, through the hose. And this hose is typically ran to the garden. Um, it's a normally open valve. So whenever power is applied, the valve is actually closed. So right now, there's power applied, the valve is closed. You can see there's no water running. Uh, to start off, we'll just go the easy way. This switch, it's a manual switch. Flip this up. You can see the water is running. Uh, whenever the water is running, I always have this red LED on, just so you know for sure. Turn this off light goes off, you can hear the valve close, there's no water running anymore. I also have this time mode, so you can see it defaults to two hours, got up button, down button, could increase the time, decrease the time, this button is okay, press this, it starts watering, light came on, valve's open, water's flowing, uh, this counts down, uh, as each minute goes by, and once it reaches zero, everything turns off. Or you could also press the button again to cancel it. Um, I didn't mention before, but if you use the manual button, it counts up how long you've left it on, just so you know. Um, so inside this box, we have the control circuitry which is basically an Arduino in this LCD along with these buttons. I have a relay here which controls the valve. On the bottom I have the 120 volts coming in converted to 5 volts DC for all the electronics. Uh, this front case is 3D printed by me to fit the screen and buttons. All nice. And that's it.